Here we are in the paint booth getting ready to paint this 73 and it's going to be Cortez silver with a little bit of blue pearl in it. But before we get ready to paint, I'm going over the car the last time to make a final corrections on any lines that aren't perfect. I like to get all these door gaps really nice and, and uniform. Once the uh, size of the jam is exactly the same all the way around, including the hoods and the T-tops, I like to check the actual radius and make sure that it's all uniform. And sometimes a nice little 150 grit sandpaper just one time up and down the edge will prepare that surface to be just perfectly round, just, just a smidge. Because when we apply the paint, it'll look like it's dipped in plastic when we're done. And if it's too sharp, I can tell and it just doesn't look right. So we put just a microscopic little radius to the, to the corner after we get the perfect gap. No corner or edge gets by my eye. I look at every square inch of the car and make sure that there isn't any kind of a flaw because if there is, you're going to see it through the paint. Now is the time to make all your corrections because once you paint it, you can't do it anymore. Everything is nicely sanded, at least down to a, a 400 grit sandpaper and uh, then we're going to blow it off, maybe wipe it down one quick time with 600 and then we're going to apply the first uh, coat of primer sealer and then an hour after that we're going to put the first coat of water base Cortez Silver with a little pearl. Let's see how this comes out. Jack is one of the painters that is that is uh, out of, uh, let's say out of the ordinary painter because he does some stuff that other painters cannot do, you know? And uh, that's what that's what it's all about. You should be you, at the end of the results. Uh, you should you should be able to see the difference because Jack is a special man. He always plays around with his with his colors and he comes up with the real good real good colors and pearls and that's what he uses on his vehicles and that's why the man is a successful painter. Jack and I work very close, you know. Uh, everything he needs and uh, we make an effort to have it here for him whenever he needs it and if we don't have it we get it for him because Jack is the king.